Not only will you get Skype experiences in widescreen HD with the best living room. But <laughs> really good at that. On your TV. It is a good duck sound. Let's take a look at Skype in snap mode. You do duck sound with it. Ooh, snap face? mode. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and grab my movie and zoom back to it. And to help you show it off, I've asked my friend DJ, Spoilers. one of the members you on the sports team, you can't move or like tell a story or anything. You want to find a hand talker? Sorry, Becky. You want to find a hand talker? You want to find a hand talker? Oh yeah, don't gesture. Yeah. No, no, we've I've fucked that up on the show before, making gestures and it it thinks that I'm trying to do something. <laughs> oh god. Um, so he calls in one of the what does he call him? DJ. DJ. His name Wait. is DJ. My buddy DJ. And to help you show it off, I've asked my friend DJ, one of the members on our sports team, to call in. One of the members on our sports team. They're and really big on the jocks right now, too. In. All their demo videos involve Xbox. guys that are like Answer really call. jockey, really douchey. Nice. <laughs> hey, DJ. Thank you for calling in to help me show off Skype in snap mode. Hey, DJ. See, I think his name's... Looks like... <laughs> his name's David. Hey, you his name's David Jernang. Yeah, it looks like you're doing okay yourself. I'm looking forward to you showing off the great nice work with our No, he looks like an asshole. Head. He's a dickhead. Well, as a matter of fact, that's what's Wait. coming up next. Look at so his dickish shaped head. That's oh. great. It is shaped Just like make a sure dick. when you get to fantasy, you show the real version. I guess you know, so. Who wears blue well, shirts? I'm in first place. Yeah. By the way, <laughs> who wears blue shirts? <laughs> By the way, that's completely pre-recorded. And because not only that, they felt the ne necessity, just like a record button on like a TV show showing a camera recording something, they've degraded the audio. Skype audio is often better than that. Why wouldn't they show the best case scenario? Listen to this. Just make sure when you get to fantasy, oh, yeah. you show the real version. You know, the one where I'm in first place. Yeah. Uh, Why so just cool. to prove that, to make you feel like it's but real when it wasn't, that Xbox, is to degrade the audio? Offering that DJ was talking about. It wasn't just scripted, guys. The that Xbox. was pre-recorded. There's the no way that was real. You talked Skype being in full screen HD. That was in the All corner. All right, let me set up the scene. <laughs> Imagine I'm not It was either, yeah, that or their mics are shit, so that's like confirmation that the yeah. Connect mic is shit? Okay, fine. At home, watching an NBA game during the regular season, but if you're like me, I what like if to I keep up with my playoffs? fantasy team. <laughs> oh, <laughs> what if you want to keep the playoffs? It's necessarily a separate device. Coaching fantasy league. Here, like LeBron, <laughs> I automatically get an alert that just pops up hey, on the TV. Hey, he likes LeBron! Xbox, I like LeBron too! Well, Don't we all like LeBron James? And now I get my fantasy <laughs> player. Thing pops up? Whenever right LeBron James scores a point, you're watching the fucking game. game! Okay, the thing is, <laughs> you can bring that up also at any time, look up stats on players. I'll even admit, that's kind of cool. Yeah, but that's the thing cool. is, it's the kind of cool that you show off to your dad or, or your, like, yeah. your buddy yeah. one time, and then... It's not your lead from, off. From that day forward, you use your, your, your laptop. And yeah, your tablet. Yeah. You'll never use that feature again after the first time you show it off. And that stats update live. But in addition, I can go ahead and check out league standings. And you can He's see. He's using smart glass to do DJ this. DJ with that score from LeBron. Always good when you're doing the demo. And in addition, I can go ahead here and I have a nice thing called featured highlights. So I can see clips this of This isn't the last you're going to see of sports. <laughs> don't think even if I'm not yeah, here. So let me throw this one to the full That's screen. Ridiculous. Remember here's this game's center, live at 10 in the morning. Chandler. And here's how he helps me. Dominate the fantasy league with plays like that. Always very nice. Don't try to act dynamic right, on scripted this show. An example of it's what weird. we can do with live TV. But can you imagine what we Good could effort. do with the Super Bowl no. or the Golden Globes? <laughs> I can imagine political debates with this ability to have interactive TV. political debates. All right, finally, <laughs> they've already actually done that to some success. Uh, the political debates were actually pretty good on Xbox, apparently. Hmm. Um, in addition, also, I just want to say this is like this is the third in a line of shitty, shitty Xbox <laughs> press conferences. Yeah. Remember this: the only highlights we've seen in the past three years Free is Xbox? people looking like idiots using Connect, Usher. Where had Usher? Uh, There's Usher um, this year. Uh, uh, Maybe Trey Parker and Matt Stone coming out to show the stick of truth. Yeah, yeah, that was. Strange. And um, uh, uh. Is that an Xbox exclusive? Uh, Connect Sesame Street and Tim Jeez. Schaefer double coming fun. out. Double fun. D Tim, Tim Schaefer coming out and saying that he got tips about his body um, from Cookie Monster. <laughs> right. Those are like the only yeah, highlights in three years of streaming uh, of the, these conferences. Anyway, so I don't know what we were expecting. Tackle what I think is the biggest challenge with watching TV. Challenge! Buddy. A challenge while watching <laughs> TV. <laughs> And keeping up. Sorry. Right. Finding out what to watch, he says, the is the challenge. Guys. I've been suffering through 27 years of Xbox. challenging the TV watching. I'm <laughs> Discover and watch TV in three powerful new ways. Uh oh. Voice control, search, and one. navigation, favorites, and training. Look at all that shit TV With on. Xbox one, yeah. Yeah. See, all There's a whole TV lot of shit there. Right <laughs> Over 500 channels. And it can be an old bird. 
But Diamond he just said the most Diamond popular TV show. Today's Welcome show. to being homesick from school. Oh, what? that was always <laughs> awful. Ooh, what's this? What the fuck? Watching oh, TV. Shit. Hair what's on thing? HBO? Wrong Wait a second. <laughs> what, a, <laughs> what about this is making things easier? You can just say... To find out what to watch? This is the exact yeah, same yeah, thing that's a challenge to find out what to watch as it is. Yep. Channel flipping. Yeah, yeah. You have to find out what Channel to watch. This you don't have, you don't have to use your hands, to go. <sighs> Yeah. Do you remember, yeah. do you remember what, what, what the Nintendo... Trying to think about the name of... <laughs> what was the command I had to say? Do you remember what Nintendo did? They came out with a service that I don't even use, as useful as it kind of is. It will take your, you put in what services you mm. own, Netflix, yeah. Hulu, yeah. your cable provider. It will then go out through all of them and tell you what's available right at this moment, what things you have watched before mm. and like and that are on. In the case of Netflix, that doesn't really apply, but then also what you might like based on what you've been watching. It, they don't mention anything like that here. They just say, you can do this, or you can watch on, let's see that what's again. the most, go see what the most popular shows are right yeah. now. That's it. Yeah. Top, Top 40. Top let's see, 40. Let's see. Huh. Big Bang. Watch CBS. <laughs> Show the guy. <laughs> Show the guy. See how easy that is? No you have to remember the name of all the networks. networks. No, just remember your three best networks. Easy. It makes it easier to, to see what's on. Okay. Just watch Xbox three networks. Favorites. Okay. Telemundo. The favorites area is an easy way to keep up with all the Big TV shows deal. that I like to watch. You can do this on a PVR too. The content oh. in one convenient place. It's a lot you can do this on any cable box channel. now. And finally, there's one of the areas I like the most. Xbox trending. Oh, <laughs> trending. <laughs> Show me what's trending. Watching. I like how current it is. There's one thing what Xbox likes. It's <laughs> what's <laughs> popular. <laughs> yep. the most popular shows. Look at that Rob Diedrich. But trending isn't just for live TV. There's also a section for video oh on demand, God. so I can see what people are liking no matter what time zone it's in. <laughs> Xbox, go home. <laughs> yeah, Xbox. <laughs> go home! Yeah. Go, yeah. go home, Xbox! You're drunk. Go, go home! home. Music, web, and now, Skype and live TV. The one place where you are now at the center of your entertainment, the one place Get where out of here, Xbox! to connect with your friends. Wait, Fang, Xbox. This is the beginning yeah. of a yeah. new generation of games like entertainment. Scene. This is the beginning of truly intelligent TV. Now I'd like to what? welcome Mark Witten to the stage. He's gradually the magic getting and science for that makes years all of this now. possible behind the Xbox One. The magic and science that makes all this possible. Coming up. Ooh. He's going to talk about the magic that goes into it. I hate magic. Thank you, Seth. Oh. Xbox, we're focused on how you play and how you're entertained. <laughs> We're driven to build a future-proof system that brings I together like the, the personality cloud, of your smart device. Yeah. I got good ones. You got personality. <laughs> I've worked on your entertainment. You said oh, like you TV and yeah. the high performance says, of Xbox. I don't know what one. I'm doing. <laughs> and I never will. <laughs> I was that a separate comment for yourself, Deegan? I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> there are three ambitious investments that we made to drive a new generation of entertainment. First, there's the console and the revolutionary Xbox One architecture. Second, advances with the most important input devices, Connect, connect the controller, too. and Smart Glass. Yeah. And third, Xbox Live, reinvented by the power of the cloud. Power so starting cloud. with our system, it's connected Clouds, man. Everybody loves it's the cloud right now. Yeah. It the yeah. of the new generation. But nobody knows what it means. Part nobody defines it. There's no real it's definition of what the cloud is. It's a cloud. It's just, it's just it's magic. Of RAM the Xbox 360 <laughs> yeah. to over 5 billion transistors. In Who are you? That's a bad transistor. What's that mean? It means it's the same power as the PS4. A native 64-bit There's no. There's almost no difference between these two systems. In power. So why are you talking about the power? Who the fuck gives a Operation. HDMI. This is a modern, powerful box. Mm. Oh, a blue oh, Look at the size oh, of that massive blue hard drive. And it's a hard drive, yes. not a solid state. 500 gigabytes, not a solid state. No, not for quick booting. Even the OS doesn't run on a solid state. 500 gigabytes. You have to. Do you know how big a, a Blu-ray no. is? Eight. 50 12. gigs. I, I don't know. 50? 50 gigabytes. 50 gigabytes. Manda mandatory installation of yeah. every game. You're not going to be able Wait to have all that. Yeah, so oh what happens God. when you run out of space on the Xbox and you want to put a new game on that game and you've already used garbage. your license up? <laughs> no, no, the license stays attached to your account. So you can reinstall. But you have to reinstall. <laughs> but you have to reinstall. So in the case of 
A lot of people, a lot of any, you know, Xbox idiot fanboys are going to say something like, Did you? I never played a game after I play it. There's lots of games with stories that you don't play after, but there's lots of games that you go back and play randomly for fun when friends come over, yes. when you feel like derping around in GTA, yep. when there's ton, lots of instances in which you're going to want more than 10 games installed. And that's not even to say... All of the digital titles. Okay. How many gigs is a game? A game is not 50 gigs. Yeah, I'll admit true. it. Yeah. Games are typically nowadays, full-blown AAA titles go from 10 to 15 gigabytes on still PlayStation, the PSN. Quite a bit with only 500 gigs. That's still, yeah. Like, maybe I'm a fringe user because I buy, like, every game. But I feel like even the average user, after two years, is going to find himself kind of inconvenienced. By how much yeah. he has to uninstall and yes, I and could see games. them being fifty gigs soon. Yeah, yeah, I yeah. Mean, they could go yeah. up. Yeah, Easy. they they actually yeah. talk at length about the how much gen. they're putting text new textures in with RAM going up and texture uh, resolution going up. There's possibility that these games will start to become uh, uncharted wow, games are twenty five gigs. Pain was thirty. So there you go. Jeez. Yeah. There's like well, also I mean, if the life cycle is like five years of the system, like minimum, then. Yeah, like there's yeah. going to be there a point at which you're going to be this shitty. But mm -hmm. hey, that's and okay. Live TV recording. Xbox will have the two terabyte, four terabyte models available, f you know, within a couple Ooh. of years. So buy another Xbox. Yeah, always, <laughs> and yes. they'll have a bigger fan this in is it. A <laughs> 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 yeah. Not with now, exterior fan. Well what are you saying, Becky? You could use like external but hard drives. It's how space, can you? I don't know. They didn't. How I don't think they yeah, confirmed that. that works really? to deliver the world's greatest games. And provides the flexibility Did Sony confirm that? New Nintendo has. I just, I don't know, nobody said it, this, I was just thinking. We brought technology from across Microsoft to create an industry first. Fucking the hell. soul of the new system is the Xbox One architecture. Three operating systems in one. First of all, that's not an architecture. Our yeah. Architecture is x86 power PC or like ARM processors. It's the shit that goes on the chip is the architecture. He's talking about using an OS architect three OSs in one. What the what? fuck? I don't that's get that. Tells me yeah, that not only words. is it a buzzword, but it's an ancient buzzword. This is oh, happened. Really? This concept mm. of multiple OSs has existed for a long, 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 nice. long, long time. And, anyways, again, and the word architecture is ridiculous. That's about the chip, not the fucking OS. The first is the best of our Xbox operating system, made even better by providing deep and instant access to the hardware. So that Three OSs, that's right. Windows ME, Windows Vista, and Windows <laughs> 3.1. All in one Millennium. system. The creators are going to no eat up about it. In harnessing the power of Xbox here, One for hard drive. Oh, um, yeah. FAQ from Microsoft. Uh, the OS and installed mandatory hard, uh, software will take up, quote, a substantial amount of your 500 gig hard drive. <laughs> a substantial amount? When they won't give a number and they admit that it's substantial? They use the word substantial. And they're the ones trying to make oh, you be okay with wow. it. wow. Just an air fart. <laughs> lack of, lack of sphincter control fart. <laughs> the second is the kernel of Windows, providing consistent access to web-powered applications. The kernel of Windows. They're in the kernel. Kernel Windows. <laughs> kernel. <laughs> All right, you pussies. <laughs> We're gonna give you a fucking Xbox where you pay us every time you play the game. You fucking pussies. Only Microsoft and Xbox could bring this level of. Power okay, kernel of Windows. Shut up. I got. And it changes everything. <laughs> the Xbox One architecture enables the new experiences that you just saw from Yusuf. There's no way. Yusuf? You can switch to your yeah. game like it's yeah, a TV Cat channel Stevens? flip. Yeah, you can switch to Yusuf. What? The Star Trek movie. Cat Stevens' name is Yusuf Islam now. But how I like Cat did the Stevens. TV know Yusuf and react to He's got an awesome beard. We're bringing a new like Cat Stevens sensor with every You know who also one, likes Cat Stevens? Which puts you yeah. at Bort. the center of your entertainment. Oh, yeah. yeah. I bet. It's <laughs> completely redesigned to respond instantly to you, your voice, and your gestures. Voice is now more conversational. It's faster and it supports the entire family. That's what I said. And our Boy. new in all those times like measures the time about 13 billionths of a second. 13 billionths of a to second. Photons. Use the word photons. Hmm. Over two gigabits of data hey. per second. To understand your I world. fucking love the. I think this the is awesome technology, is. but they still have yet oh, yeah. to use yeah. it yeah. Yeah. in a good way. Yeah. And what the new experiences. Tingle like remembers Bored is the guy that Ben tried to hump three yep. years ago. <laughs> did did it? And kissed. Kiss. You the open line. mouth kiss to the William Tell Overture. Now that world is crisp. It's clear and beautiful. 
a 1080p wider field. They want the best forward door. button. No, you're suffering through this, guys. I had to watch this shit. You can watch it too with us. Yeah, yeah, in, the living room. in 2010, Connect layered in an analog understanding of how you move. But in 2013, we revolutionized this capability. Yeah. Oh. There are more joints. Yeah, it's always and that now, good. And for the first time, understanding the slightest rotation of a wrist or a shoulder. Perfection. We understand your wrist balance. Shoulder the transfer rotation. of weight from one foot to another. The energy of emotion. Where is this dick? <laughs> when you're exercising, it can <laughs> read your heartbeat. <laughs> <laughs> this is human control oh. for a yeah. human experience. Whoa. Now, we wouldn't bring you next generation gameplay without innovating on our controller. For the new generation, we're taking mm. the world's best controller the same. and we're making it better. I the Xbox it. One controller a little flatter. is updated with over 40 design innovations. 40? 40. 40. Updated ergonomics like and an integrated toast. battery compartment that <laughs> fits yeah. better for gamers of all ages. Um, Show me all these. Built in battery, one battery one now. Uh, Finally, one of the things that oh, it's funny gonna because last. that's one of the that's actually a split for gamers. I even, I mean battery split. Yeah. From from like day to day, sometimes I like being able to swap out batteries I had charging elsewhere. Yeah. Other times I like how light the PlayStation oh, controller is. At a minimum, the cord that the PlayStation comes with should be much longer. Yeah. No, no cords anymore. How do you dock? charge it? Oh, dock it. I don't know. I don't know how they do it, but yeah. I think that it's mandatory wireless controllers now. Like. I mean, like, like yeah. charging it, you know. Still uses AA batteries. Hasn't changed that part. I it's read integrated what? battery oh. compartment. That doesn't sound like. What does this mean? That sorry, guys, I didn't really look into this one that much. Whatever the details are on it, then. Impulse triggers. You said the battery would be sixteen percent larger. Into the triggers, and a newly designed longer creates precision for longer. sixties. This that is your make controls. Sense. Yeah, there's designed by the double A. I don't get it. For the next generation. Okay. So I was wrong then. We All right. can't talk about input innovation. So some people really like that. Others, last year, that's a give or take. It's subjective. I kind of like the battery thing. with your Xbox. I do. I like the light PlayStation controllers. Yeah, how light they are. And a Super deep light. companion it's experience. So badass. And they charge. We've had over that's 10 million time. downloads of Smart Glass for the Xbox 360. But with this new smart generation, glass. your smart device will Ooh. behave like it's born to work with Xbox One because it's natively part of the platform. That's good. Yeah, rechargeable controller. Smart glass. Innovative, Smart glass. familiar devices to Ooh. your Honestly, experience. Honestly, this is so boring. Yeah, uh, yeah. But the real uh, magic is what yeah. happens when um, all of these devices work together. Like, the devices are going to work together. No, they talk, they they're talk. They're going to work together. The power between these devices. Like when you press power on, like or the um, on, Captain when you Planet the kids. Channel on your Smart Glass. Yeah, they work yes. together. Connect seamlessly makes it work. When you pick up your controller, Connect recognizes you and the controller. Captain Planet Kids and probably wouldn't like those uh, disposable discs. Wait yeah. a second. It he knows just how said I when you it? pick up the controller, yeah. it will recognize recognizes you? you. That's bullshit. Yeah, I don't know how that's. That is bullshit. Have they given details to that? Yeah, little there's no fucking quit? way that it will know the difference between me and Fraser yeah. picking up a controller. No way. Well, okay, this is what it can do. The Connect can recognize you, so maybe okay. the second you pick up a controller, maybe. it's like you want to play, so it's going to start trying to recognize your voice. Or I mean your your face. Maybe at that moment or something oh, like your face. Oh, that's fucking weird. Follow your man. commands. Raise your controller and a virtual shield follows. The connect which your flawlessly does that every single time. Yeah. Always yeah. always yeah. recognizes you perfectly. Wow. <laughs> Even the employees didn't know when to clap. Uh, I guess uh, yeah. but they had to enthusiastically as well. To truly evolve the next generation <laughs> of games and entertainment, you need access to the most powerful entertainment service. The new Xbox Live is built on Xbox One to amplify an all-new generation. Huh? Based on oh, the same membership words. you have today, but Stand now more fast, powerful, dude. more personal, it's the exact and same. more intelligent. It's the exact fucking same. When we Nothing's Xbox changed with Xbox, Xbox One. Intelligent. It was powered by 500 servers. With the advent of the 360, that number had grown to over 3,000. Today, 15,000 servers power the modern Xbox Live experience. I hope so. 15,000. But this year, 000. we will have more than 300,000 servers for Xbox One. That means nothing. Three hiddle busy giddles. This means nothing. In 1999. Video courtesy of something else. NASA. Lots of servers. Let's talk about the wow, those servers aren't even rack mount. How stupid. Your content is available <laughs> stored in the cloud. Sitting so on a floor somewhere. <laughs> in music, some guy's your basement. Games, <laughs> your saves anytime, anywhere. As you've seen today, live brings all new experiences. Including well, yeah, Skype, some people say, are they smaller servers? I even might say that they might be virtual TV. machines. Like, 
and playing games. One physical server equals 100 servers or something. Just imagine. You will now have a dedicated game DVR to capture and access your magic moments and save them to the In-game DVR, share button. Mm. Mm -hmm. Is this the reason they pushed back the conference? Because that was the killer feature that PlayStation had? Because, here's my speculation. Let's see how long he features this, this groundbreaking feature. Cloud. With our native editing and sharing tools, you'll have the most amazing bragging rights on Xbox Live. Uh-huh. Achievements become that's dynamic just, and that's it. over, eh? That's fucking it? <laughs> hmm, I wonder. I just wonder mm -hmm. if among the reasons you pushed back the conference, it was to go to your engineers and say, PlayStation's got this share button. Kids love sharing their fucking footage. They probably actually like this feature quite a bit. Can we do that? I'll give you a couple weeks to figure out whether we can yeah. do it at launch so that I can decide whether we put that in the conference. Then when the engineers said, I think we can do it, they said, okay, mock me up a little shitty video to put behind me, yeah. make up a, u a user interface, act like it's an actual feature so that I can show it off. Sony came out, demonstrated the fucking thing, yeah. showed you, yeah. had... <laughs> Had a gameplay a gameplay it. played on stage yeah. with what was it? Uh, fucking I don't remember. Uh, Killzone played. came out and played Killzone, then immediately posted the video that he played immediately from the stage yeah. to Facebook. Oh, That's already? fucking impressive. We thought that might have been fake, didn't we? Did we, we thought it was, but it was verified it was to be real. real. It was exactly what he played, and people Knack? like what was the Knack? game? Knack. Oh, Killzone. Knack. 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 What the fuck's a Knack? Knack. Knack. Maybe that yeah, the name. It wasn't the game where like the thing had the stuff. What the hell oh, yeah. <laughs> Jeez. You know, it was like made of blocks no, and no, shit. No, no, Killzone did it too, guys. Anyway, whatever. What, it, the point is, they demonstrated, and it was really impressive that it had a, a service which they demonstrated to be fully ready to go already. Yeah. This they, is not ready well, to go. Well, they talked about it. <laughs> not just what you do. You will play richer matches Bong. with the future of matchmaking. And our new There's game, no way your ass will ever made that sound. Your <laughs> your ever <laughs> game uh, well, what kind of food would do that? While you ah, watch a movie, chili? Oh, God. Uh-oh, we did. <laughs> yeah, yeah, chili. Yeah. Stuff that cowbell. Game developers yeah. can take advantage of our worldwide <laughs> multi-data center that infrastructure to drive direct game computation. What? All right, game we're back for more details on how amazing everything is. Stick around. They left it.